What is up everyone, it's your boy Mad Panda. Today we're gonna be playing part two of Assassin's Creed Liberations. And uh yeah, let's uh let's get it. Let's get started. I think this is where they're gonna teach us how to go into like these little um uh, I guess it's called chamber to like change from different personas, which I really enjoy this. I do remember this uh, uh little feature from the first time I played it. So uh, let me explain it real quick, or from what I know is that you could change from your assassin persona. And uh if guards see you, I do believe that they get like like their notoriety high, they get suspicious. Then there's the slave persona, which I think you're able to go into uh, plantations without really being detected. And then there's your noble persona, which uh, basically you're seen as a noble, but you can't move as fast as normal. Like normally you do, right? Because you're wearing this uh, big, elegant dress. dress. And uh, I really like how they're playing these factors into like the gameplay itself, which is uh, it changes up the gameplay itself because you could go into a plantation and risk getting caught more easier. But uh, you could choose to like change it to like blend in, you know, uh, or you could like change into a noble to like also blend in and uh, get to, you know, maybe there's a party in here and you're going to require it. It's, it's got to be pretty interesting. I, I'm enjoying it. I like that. Uh, it says press. Okay, I thought it's up. Right, so I think this is where we're going to choose which one we have. I think we only have this one. Uh, okay, so yeah, this is the noble persona. So it's a uh, change into this one? Yeah. Alright, I think you don't have any weapons in this person. Delivery will arrive at the plantation. A perfect cover. Hide in a wagon and follow the cart to discover the location without being seen. Alright, so let's actually look at the minimap, see where we're going exactly. Probably on my own time, I'm just gonna like explore around New Orleans, open up the area a bit more and stuff. It's back over there. So yeah, from what I see right now, I only have my hidden blades. I do not have the pistol that I equipped. Or a, or a sword that I saw voice alert on her belt. Oh, oh my bad. It's kind of giving me like those assassins to create uh, vibes for some reason. I don't know why. It really, it really gives me those vibes. So I think we're pretty close now. Yeah, this city is definitely smaller than uh, the previous cities we were in Assassin's Creed 3. And uh, I guess it does make sense. Uh, since. Wait, did they notice me? Okay. Wait, those aren't soldiers, are they mercenaries? Fucking dude going sleeveless over there. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so right now something I'm also noticing is that free running is not bad at all. It's uh pretty fluent as well. Uh, it kind of feels like Assassin's Creed uh Assassin's Creed uh 3. Well, that's basically I feel like that's where they took the free running from, you know? But it really gives me that feeling and uh I'm liking it so far. It's pretty smooth. Each game really improves it. Hide in the wagon. Oh, shit, we're timed. Why would they time this? <laughs> Take the crate and pass the guards to crate. Okay, I see him. What do you say? Oh my god. I'm such a noob. I, I'm sorry, guys. I am so sorry about this. Um, I totally forgot to 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 put in the the subtitles. I'm pretty sure I don't have the subtitles on. Uh, I just want to apologize for that because that's such like a noob freaking thing of me to do, you know? I don't think I've missed subtitles in any game like this. I apologize once again. I still can't understand what homeboy is saying over here. I have some throat problems. Warning restricted area. Wait, I should be able to pass through, right? Pardon me, gentlemen. Hmm. I wonder if you would be able to plant pass by it, like dressed as a noble woman or not. I wonder what her thing would, would actually work with, besides just like blending in with high society and stuff. 
I don't think I could run or else like they are definitely gonna get pretty suspicious. So we're pretty close by. I'm gonna stop here. There we go. So maybe if I get way too close to them, that's when they get more suspicious and stuff. So I gotta keep my distance as well. Who are you? How did you get past the guards? We have plenty of trouble here already. Don't need no more. I'm Aveline, a friend. Slaves have been reported escaped, but none has yet reached any safe house. My contacts fear the worst. If you're a spy, Avelyn, you won't find no cause for persecution here. My brothers have vanished, then my aunt, today my youngest sister, Therese. They ain't escaped, as you say. They're taken. Besides, Therese would never survive on her own. I'll find her. If any have trodden through these... They must have left tracks. Climb the plantation mansion and scout the area. All right. Mm. Wait, I think there's a guard over there. Same dude. Oh, let's get it. <clears throat> so it shouldn't be that high over there. All right. Wait, you can climb on trees on this one too? Oh, okay. That's nice. I didn't know that. Okay, I, I did not remember that. Like I said, I don't really remember much of this game besides maybe a few like key moments that happen, but that's about it. Like not even the gameplay besides you know the chain clothes, because that's really something unique for the franchise that no other game had done to that point. I investigate the barn. Don't be afraid, Therese. I'm a friend. Who did this? Your master? No. This son. Oh, please help. Be strong. I'll get you to safety. You'll pay for this. Guards, hurry! We've got rats in the barn. <laughs> kind of looks like Pinocchio. Pinocchio was a real boy. <laughs> Uh, only, only, only punches? Defend yourself? Oh, shit. Oh, we got the machete. Oh, damn. Well, there goes the, the sun. I think that was the sun. Nightmare. I can't take no more. His terror is over, Therese. Stay with me. We must hurry. Damn. Uh, do we have the little machete still? That was actually a pretty cool weapon. Okay, no, so we only have our fists and the hand blade. I might actually see if I can loot them, see uh, what we get from them besides some money. Do we get money? Yeah. Oh, that's a lot, actually. 38? Well, maybe. It could it, it could also depend that things are really expensive in this game, so there's that. Skip. <gasps> Avelyn, my daughter, wandering alone at dawn. Where have you been? After the nightmare, I went to take air. Dear stepmother, I'm grown now. You needn't worry for my safety. You underestimate the dangers of the world. If not your safety, then to your reputation. Why must you be so headstrong? I wish you would. In truth, Madeleine, I'm in need of your assistance. I'm afraid it's urgent. What now? While walking, I was startled by cries of distress. Following them, I discovered a woman, a slave, badly wounded. Where is she? I will send help. She awaits in a wagon, outside, in the street. Evelyn! Don't be cross. I knew you'd know the thing to do. I couldn't risk leaving her to perish, or worse. Or worse! You have already sentenced her to persecution by your very impulsiveness. <sighs> very well. I will not turn my back now, not that you have left me much choice. 
I will see that she is treated in utmost discretion. Ah, <sighs> thank you, Madeleine. In the meantime, hurry to town and fetch her new traveling clothes. Go quickly. We have no time to lose. I feel like we kind of missed something there when we saved the the, the girl Terrier. Uh, I can't pronounce my, her name. Excuse my ignorance. But I felt like we we missed something there, um, like an extra cutscene because that was kind of random. Popping up at home, all dressed up and shit. Yeah, so our running is really limited. Uh, turn down posters. Those are some stiff ass posters. I'm not sure if like the other sequence ended or not. What is this? It's like a little heart. Charm? Wait, so what does this do? Oh, hell no, he's gonna be following me? So, maybe he's like a noble that could get me to other places? I don't know, man. I'm gonna keep following me over here. Is he chasing? Oh man, he's chasing! Oh god. So, wait, so what's the point of charming? Oh man. Okay, so okay, yeah, we're going back. Uh traveling clothes. Select. Okay, I can see. I don't know why I'm acting like such a noob right now. Oh god, he's still waiting for me. I'm out this hole. <laughs> Run, Evelyn. 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 I can't say her last name because I just can't pronounce it. Once again, I, I'm really bad at pronunciations. I think, like, his love me. Oh, no. It's still there. It's still there. He, they do have, like, a love meter, right? Where, like, if I ignore them enough, like, they'll just bounce and shit. Or maybe not. Yo, stay away from me, cut. Gotta beat his ass. Evelyn, late to lunch and looking ashen again. I fear you are not resting enough. Oh, Papa, I'll take my rest when this life is exhausted. You will hasten that end at this rate. I do fear you are more like your father than his feet for a lady. A chip of the same block. In passing, Monsieur Blanc requests your assistance at the warehouse. I dare say he has work to offer. Is that all he has to offer? I should think for all his attention, he would request your and. All the same, it's the work that interests me. Philip. Homegirl in the back has a five head. Oh, by the turn of this conversation, it would appear I have lingered too long at this table. If you'll excuse me. Good day, Papa. <sighs> there, he is gone. I can tell you now, Aveline. Oh, are they I eating? I have taken care of everything. Your friend will be safe. If you have any more womanly problems do not hesitate to see me that was a random ass fucking little music like cue right there <laughs> but oh wait there's a cousin uh, I know his memory since the parents of her mother Evelyn has been raised by Madeline de Liesel I can't pronounce it my bad with the realization that they shared similar views on slavery, the bond between the two women grows stronger. I'm not gonna end it just yet because uh, I want to see if there's like a a cutscene. This anime is like room. It's pr probably one of my favorite ones. It looks pretty pretty dope. So I I could cause crimes with like any suit on, and I guess those like the top corner. Uh, it shows like what my uh, what my meter is with like crime wise and stuff. Okay, so so I guess for each one respectively, I would have to rip posters. Or hold on, let me actually try this. Oh no, it works with anyone. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna be ending the video here. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.